Well, I had some uh, reoccurring wounds on my legs that would just wouldn't heal. Uh, it seemed to be worse in the winter time. Well, I had had them probably on and off for a couple of years, but uh, it seemed to have gotten worse in the end of 2011. Many of the patients that we see that have wounds have had them for many years. On um, several occasions, we've seen patients that have had wounds more than 20 years. They typically are getting seen at wound care centers or getting treated by a variety of uh, other healthcare providers um, without success. These wounds occur on the legs. They are frequently very painful. They are not associated with diabetes, which is a common misnomer. They're caused by venous insufficiency or varicose veins. I had gone to a local hospital, to a wound center, and uh, spent about a month there doing different things, going back every week, and it was no different and I decided I was just wasting my money there, so. He came in, we uh, performed a venous Doppler ultrasound on him, diagnosed venous insufficiency. We corrected that venous insufficiency on him using endovenous radiofrequency ablation of the vessels, and his, all his uh, wounds healed up very promptly, less than two months. In fact, some of them were healed within a couple of weeks. You know, he seemed to have a little bit, you know, better idea what it was. It was a circulation issue as far as the veins, and he, he talked to me about the different veins that they could do as far as the closing off of things and and I was all for it. He said that you know he think he thought it would heal up within uh, you know no time and he was correct. Treating those veins results in relatively rapid resolution or healing of the wounds. Probably the number one reason why I uh, began to specialize in the treatment of venous insufficiency was that I uh, discovered that it was the solution to these chronic wounds that had previously not been treatable. Uh, seeing Dr. Morgan, uh, he was very personable, he's easy to uh, trust right off the bat, uh, knew what he was talking about, uh, very friendly staff. Like I said, uh, I've never had any issues since and uh, you know I've been uh, very happy with the experience.